people, I'm Therese. I am your ambassador for Dossier Perfume. First of all, I want to thank Dossier for allowing me to be their ambassador for this beautiful perfume line. So in the background, we have our peony candle going and we have our orange blossom going. So let's dive right in. So I just want to give a little bit of a public service announcement. So this, since this is spring going into summer, we have a lot of babies out on the highway. We ran into some geese on the way home and I literally just pulled over because I was just praying that nobody would hit them. It was like a four lane highway. So you guys, please be careful of all the little babies out on the highway. Geese, I don't know, they just don't care. They, have, they don't care. Four lanes of highway, there were some in the front, there were some in the back of me, and they just don't care, they just wanna cross. So we have to be careful of them because they just don't know any better. So let's dive right in to the perfume. So first of all, Dossier, I want everybody to be able to sample this perfume. You guys are welcome to use my discount link right below this video, and you guys can get yourself some great perfume. Now we're gonna start off with the Woodsies. So this is Woody Oak Moss. This is $29 from Dossier and it retails for $105. This is inspired by Chanel Coco Mademoiselle. And you guys always get like a beautiful note card that tells the notes who is who it is inspired by. They give the top notes, middle notes, and the base notes. And uh, it's just, oh my gosh, first of all, Coco Mademoiselle, I'm out of it. So let's go ahead and sample this. And again, I just love, I love the cat. Let me tell you about this video too. I can tell you what's in this video. I might as well say what is not in this video. So we did shopping, we did a little bit of lunch, and uh, of course we have a haul for you and a little bit of spring decorating. So first of all, oh my gosh, Coco's, the Coco's, any of Chanel's is absolutely my favorite. This smells so good. The top notes are bergamot, orange, and peach. I mean, that is just perfect for spring. So next up we have the Woody Coriander. So this is inspired by D&G, the one for men. And I do wear men's cologne too. And don't be afraid to layer it. I mean, you can make up a whole new perfume just by using a couple of scents. So this is $29 from Dossier and it retails for $96. And let me just tell you about the retail. They are very conservative when they give you the retail amount because pretty much 99.9% .9 of these scents, if you go online or you go into the stores, it is way more than what they are saying they are at retail. So let's go ahead. And I love that everything is in a box and it's recyclable. And I mean, just how pretty would these boxes be on your vanity? So let's go ahead with this one. Mm, this smells good. This would be a great layering scent. So next up is the Woody Basil. This is inspired by YSL and they have dropped the Y. They used to be called Yisei Laurent and now they're called just Saint Laurent. And this is um, Le Homme au Doy Toila, if I pronounce it correctly. So this is Woody Basil. Um, it retails for $78 and it is only $29 from Dossier. I, I don't know, I think the woodsy scents are like some of my favorites. And it just, you know, brings you back to like a day a great memory, you know, when you went to a concert or you had a great date or, uh, you know, you had a, just just some nice time with friends. Mm. And I'm sorry, you guys, I haven't seen you in a while, but I am the film editor production crew. And uh, yeah, it takes a long time to edit these videos, um, but I just went out enjoying my life. So uh, hopefully we'll, we'll be doing a lot more videos this year. So next up is a citrus green apple. This is inspired by Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue for Women. It retails for $82, which again is a very, very conservative amount. 
and this is $29 from Dossier. Guys, I just love the caps. Again, you can put these in your purse and they will not spill. And this is actually, this is a lot of perfume. This is 50 mLs. I mean, that's, that's a huge, huge bottle because the most of the perfumes, they're at least half. Mmm. This is absolutely, I think this is like one of my favorites. So this is Gourmand White Flowers. This is inspired by Victor and Rolf Flowerbomb. So this is a very popular perfume. It retails for $115, which again, I've seen it. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is at least $150 retail. And it is $29 from Dossier. Mmm. It smells so good. You know, oh my gosh. I mean, this would just be lovely just to kind of like spray in the air and kind of like walk into it. <laughs> it smells so good. Now our next scents are Amberries. This is Amberry Saffron. This is inspired by Maison Francois Couchigan. So it is Baccarat Rouge 540 Eau de Parfum. This is $49 from Dossier. You guys, it retails for $300. I mean, I can't afford $300 perfumes. So the fact that actually I can get this from Dossier is just, it's amazing. Oh my gosh. I know, Coco. It's very exciting. Very exciting. Wow. Wow. Next up we have Amberry Sage. This is inspired by Tom Ford F. Bleach Ing Fabulous Eau de Parfum. So this is $49 from Jose. This retails $350. Okay. So, so excited to try this. Oh yes, this is blinking fabulous. <laughs> Next up is Amberry Tuberose. So this is $29 and it retails for $98. It is inspired by Diptyque, which is Dubon Eau de Parfum. The top notes are orange, blossom, and rose, you guys. I love rose perfume. Love it. Oh my gosh. You can definitely smell the roses. This is amazing. Last but not least, we have Musky Rose. This is inspired by Narciso Rodriguez for her Eau de Parfum. $29 from Dossier and it retails for $102, you guys. So this is would be a great layering scent and I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do with it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is, this is like the perfect layering scent. Perfect. This is a little behind the scenes footage. <laughs> So these are actually so lifelike and I'm going to show you a little bit later. I do have some real peonies and I was actually going to get rid of these but I didn't realize how much they looked like the real thing and I love these and I actually washed these. I've had these for a long time. I got them from Home Goods, and I love that they have little words on them and whatnot so I'm going to show you what I'm going to do with the perfume. So what we're going to do is we're going to spray a little bit of the musky rose. And we're gonna spray a little bit of the Amberry Tuberose. Oh my gosh, you guys, I wish I had smell -a vision It smells so wonderful. And with the candles going right here, again, the peony and the orange blossom. With the scents I just sprayed on this, oh my gosh, my room smells so good so again thank you for dossier for allowing me to be your perfume ambassador thrilled and honored and 
just beyond my wildest expectations. I have never had so much perfume in my entire life, and thank you so much. I really, really do appreciate it. So you guys, don't forget to use my discount link right below this video. So now we're going to do a little bit of shopping. We actually went to lunch, and we just did a tiny bit of shopping. We are Ray done hunting at Home Goods. you guys I always used to do just CVS videos and actually using our care pass and our extra bucks we got some free items so I'm going to show those to you so we ended up getting the shirt you guys okay so these are in like the tour section this was um, $10.99 .90, but actually ended up getting it for free with my extra bucks pass because you get $10 a month I mean look at that I love the words you guys look at that amazing love that then we picked up a second shirt the following month and this is chicago oh my gosh look at that love that love that very very proud of my hometown chicago also so we went to oh my gosh my wings are falling off here okay so let's just switch around the rings a little bit here because they're falling off okay that's much much better okay so we went to Michael's the other well, well a few weeks ago and um, we're trying to be minimalistic and you know it takes time <laughs> so I ended up picking these up I'm not sure exactly what I'm gonna do with them yet I was gonna plant some flowers in here but I thought that would be really a mess and these are pretty sturdy as you can see they've got like rivets in here but I don't know how much this will actually hold and we were actually shopping and I only found one of them and I thought, you know, let me just go back through. And this one, I guess somebody had put it back. So we got this and of course they're 40% off. I mean, mainly most of their items are 40% off. And then we picked up this one too. So we have two of these and one of these again. I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do with them. But yes, Coco, it's, I know you're so excited. Coco says well. <laughs> So I'm not sure exactly what we're going to do with them, but I think they would be, they would go really good, um, especially with my baskets right here, because those are pretty much going to stay up for like ever. And um, because, you know, we just want to be out enjoying life. There we go. And, you know, I love doing videos for you guys, but we have just been really enjoying our life. And I do have a full-time job and um, yeah, I'm very, very, very busy. Um, so I'm hoping that I will actually have more videos for you guys this year. So next up, actually, okay, this is really sad. This was in my garage and I totally forgot I had it. So, um, we'll just show it to you. So this is a Star Dreamer sleep mask, you guys. This was like a clearance for $3.99. And, oh my gosh, this is so cute. Look at this. Look how cute that is. Look how cute that is. Love that Juicy Couture. I know Coco. Well, you can borrow it if you want to. 
And then we got a dual action facial cleansing brush. This is not electronic, but again, I have like the Clarisonic. And you guys, I'd rather just use something like this. I mean, this is so soft and this is silicone, which will never wear out. And um, I mean, that would just look so fabulous, like on your vanity. And uh, yeah, that's so, so cute. And then I went ahead and picked up one of these boxes. This is from BB. And this was $7.99. And it's just, I actually have one like this in my bathroom. It's actually clear, um, but it's bigger. And I'm going to put one each of these in my bathrooms. So I think that is just so cute. It's, it's elegant. It's going to stay out all year long. And this way, instead of decorating, redecorating, putting stuff away, organizing it, buying a ton more stuff, we're just going to, you know, be a little bit more simplistic. Now, this is from Cuisinart. This was $3.99, you guys. These are, these are pretty expensive. Um, and this is like a bamboo top. And this actually, well, it's got tape on it and stuff like that. But as you can see right here, and it's actually good for a few food storage container. And I actually got two. This is a little bit different. Um, this is like more oblong and, you know, you can put like fruits and stuff like that, you know. And when I bring them to work, I would rather have something like this. And you just have to be really careful about glass containers because your lunch bag will be super heavy. And that is really annoying having to carry a heavy bag into work. I mean, it's, you know, it really... Um, it can really hurt your shoulder over time. You'd really be surprised. And it doesn't matter your age. If you're in your 20s carrying those big, huge, heavy backpacks, it really takes a toll. So, you know, just be aware of that. So I thought that was really, really cute. Now, I'm being very simplistic, okay? So I actually found these towels at Home Goods, and I'm going to show you. So these are eco friendly, and they are actually made from bamboo and I've gotten rid of all my towels and I just bought new ones I haven't bought new towels oh my gosh you guys years and years and years years and years and years all different colors I only use one washcloth at a time each towel I might use you know like two to three times I know some people do wash their towels every day and that's fine um, you know whatever whatever works for you so yeah this is $7.99 and this is beautiful it's huge you guys I mean it's huge and open it up for you and I think this is a really great great price on a towel and again just having everything one color like I love the Kardashians okay I do Kim's house is just kind of like monochromatic um, it's all like tan and I want my house to be kind of like all gray and it's just it's so soothing you know because all of my towels were all different colors and they didn't match and like if you buy a set of towels okay really invest in the washcloth the washcloth might end up costing you a little bit more um so we ended up buying three sets and then we were only able to find like two of the hand towels you know they come in a bundle of two and i didn't want to buy four so i thought i'll just buy two and then we'll just use you know we'll just have to we'll just have to use them as we as we use them so um and then the washcloths i got a set of five so if you do buy a set of towels really buy more washcloths because for me i've always used just one washcloth so if you have a set of towels you have one washcloth one hand towel and one washcloth then they're not going to match if that makes sense so and then also what we're going to do is we're going to put them in right in here i do have to take the tags off you guys um, but as you can see, this was actually from the Dollar Tree, and I think this is really cute. I want my linen closets kind of like to have nothing in them. Just because you have a closet doesn't mean it has to be crammed full of everything. And we're doing a lot of decluttering, you guys. Put a little bit more of a gloss on. And I'm so excited to empty out my closets. And just because you have drawers in your vanity or, you know, anywhere in your house doesn't mean they always have to be full. So look forward to that decluttering video, you guys, because you got rid of a lot of stuff. Just because it's just, it's too much. I don't want all this stuff. Um, I'm an extreme couponer and I don't want to have, like, um, a stash. 
I don't like it. I've gotten rid of it. Had it before, and you know, kind of done with that. So, anyways, so I think this looks really cute, and our linen closet will be kind of empty. Some more things from Home Goods. I love this. This was $2.99. This is a little spoon rest, and I love it because stainless steel actually will go with anything. Um, again, our like pots and pans and everything are gray, so very, very excited for that. And I know I said I wasn't going to buy any more soap. I know. So this is Milk and Honey Hand Soap. Um, this is enriched, enriched with essential oils. This, um, $5.99, you guys. It smells so good. And I love glass. Oh, my God. This smells like almonds. I wish you guys could smell this. And, I mean, since I've washed my hands a million times anyways at work and, of course, at home, I want to make sure that I'm using some really, really good soap that is going to moisturize my hands. And <sighs> coconut oil and berry sugar scrub. This was $5.99. You guys, I've seen this for way more. This retails at $9. No, I've seen this, you guys. This was $25 at another store, and I'm not paying that much, so... Cocoa. Oh my god. Okay, I don't want to spill it. Oh my gosh, this is lovely. This is really gonna exfoliate your skin and then you know use it um, in the shower and then prep your skin for the moisturizer. And then we did pick this up. Uh this is from where did I get this from? Oops. Thank you. Thanks, Barbie. Apparently, Barbie didn't like that angle. So, <laughs> so actually, we picked these up the same time that we got those, um, the gray um, decor from Michaels. And no, actually, you know what, you guys? I got this from Joann's. Yeah, I did. Joann's. This is actually, this one I got from Michaels, and this is a basket. It's kind of gray. And I mean, you can hang on the wall. Again, I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do, do with it, but it's just something that I just thought very minimalistic and I can keep out all the time so we'll find a place for that um, and then from Target I got this drizzled litter mat you guys track resistant this thing is huge I mean it's plastic backing what I want to do is with my cat litter um, I actually have a dome on it because Barbie kind of goes crazy scratching because she's very aggressive <laughs> it's true Coco I know you've seen her right crazy right well crazy yeah she's 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 my little monster, but I love her. <laughs> so what I want to do is I want to have one of those like enclosed um, cat litter things, um, things um, like a cabinet, you know. So I'm really looking forward to getting that, and it really basically won't look like um, you won't see the cat litter box, which very excited. But everything right now is so expensive. The one I want is close to $300, and I think that's just a little bit too pricey for right now. So I went ahead and got this a little while ago, so we're definitely going to use this, and it definitely helps because I have something kind of like this, and this is going to go like underneath. And be before we head into the other room, so I went ahead and picked up some dishcloths. So these are Nicole Miller's from Home Goods. These. Sure these are these um, $9.99 and for three. Again, gray. I got rid of all of my Dollar Tree dishcloths. You know, dear Dollar Tree, I do love you, but as you notice, we really just don't go to the Dollar Tree anymore. I've probably been there twice this year, and this is like June. So, gray. And um, I have so many pretty dish towels that I haven't used, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm afraid they're going to get dirty. And I know all you out there are like the same as me, a little crazy. So we're going to use them. And, you know, if they get pootsed, then, I mean, you wash them. And if it doesn't come out, then, you know, whatever. I mean, I'm so tired of just trying to have everything perfect. It's, it's impossible. You can, nobody is perfect. Now, I couldn't find the little... Um, Barbie almost knocked this over again. So I couldn't find the pot holder. The, they actually have a pack of two, so I brought like another one up and they just charged me $3.99 for one. So I thought this was just really cute. Now uh, let's head into the kitchen. 
Okay, so we have a couple of additional items that I did get from CVS for free. This is the Sonic Rose Quartz Beauty Bar, and I only buy tools that I truly believe that are going to work. So first of all, this is a real quartz. This vibrates and it heats, and it's actually, um, I have to charge it a little bit more, but I'm probably not going to use the heat setting, but you guys, this is cold, and what it will do, it stimulates your skin, it stimulates collagen, and... Uh, it just, oh my God, you guys, it just feels so good. Just like you can use it right underneath your eyes. And of course, of course, don't put this in the freezer because this is electronic. But um, from the Dollar Tree again, they're Dollar Tree, I do love you. <laughs> but the ones that they have are plastic and I was really disappointed because I mean, what was I thinking of getting like a, something quartz, you know, um, real quartz for like a dollar. So definitely invest in something like this. Also too, CVS will give you like each week, sometimes twice a week, they give me like $4 extra bucks. So like right here, what I'll do is I'll just go buy like a monster and this is absolutely for free. So make sure you guys um, look, you know, look on your app for that. Also too, um, I actually got two of these, like the beauty gifts I will get like once a month and I got a, um, the free poof and I actually got another one upstairs that's gray as well. So love, love that. And then we just have a couple more things from Home Goods. So I think I showed you guys this in the past. This is like $9.99. Again, it has a topper. And you can use it any time of the year. And... Okay. Okay, so the perfect yellow. Just saw in a few of my videos. It has to be like the perfect yellow. I'm just so weird that way cup of sunshine look how pretty that is they did have like a um a lighter yellow but this is like perfect almost tweety bird but not quite tweety bird yellow and this was 6.99 and then my friend cynthia hi cynthia my bff and um so she had like the perfect gray mug and actually she bought it for her husband and i was just like then i became obsessed i'm like i need one i need one of those yes barbie what do you want food yeah <laughs> so um this is the only one that they had the other ones that they had were uh, matte and i like this as is glossy so this was like six yeah this was 6.99 as well and i know it says papa needs coffee but i am the mama and the papa to my beautiful babies so i thought this was like perfect and of course you guys we were going through our cabinet and when we bring stuff in we are going to get rid of stuff so i'm going to show you the cups i'm going to get rid of so this right here is a planner set i'm going to get rid of it's just like a little ceramic and a little base right here we're going to get rid of that reese's i got this as a gift this one came with candy in it and this one did as well so we're definitely getting rid of those so now i'm going to bring you through the house and just show you a little bit of my spring decor so this right here I've had for a long time. This is ceramic and these are just so cute. These were my mom's and I have them now. And this one just stays up all the time. And then this one, I would have this like put away and like never use it. And uh, no, we're, we're definitely using this. And this is another one that I've had that I haven't used and we are definitely using this. And this is just so pretty for summer. And I did buy this from Better Homes and Garden, a propagation station. So I have propagated some plants in the past, but basically the base right here was opaque and I didn't realize how fast they literally suck up the water and they ended up dying on me. So I actually picked this up at Wally's. This right here, so cute. We got this, um, I believe I got this at Jewel. So cute and they're blooming. And then of course, this is a spring cactus. It's just loving where it's at. I might have to move it because not Barbie, but Coco likes to munch on this. So I have my peonies actually in the fridge and they only last for a few days and I'm going to be working and so I want to enjoy them. So that's why we kept them in the fridge. But I'm going to compare my faux plants to the real ones and show you guys how realistic they are.
This is the fireplace right now. And what we want to do, hi Barb. We want to minimize everything. So these actually can stay out up, hi Coco. These actually can stay out until now. Saying hello to everybody. Hello. Oh sure, when I don't have the camera on you. <laughs> okay. So anyways, um, this little bar right here, I'm not sure exactly what I'm gonna do, but I did put, if you guys can see, I don't know if you can see in here. I put my little John Deere tractor in there, and then I have my little lights, and this is really cool. This is actually in my Amazon store, and I really love it, and you guys can see all these different colors. I showed you a million times before, but I love this. So we're definitely gonna keep that. And then I've had these guys, for, I mean, probably over 10 years. These are just really kind of like rustic candle holders. This one actually needs a new battery. We're, we're gonna go ahead and keep those out. And then this is just I, just another candle that I was burning the other day. And then we brought out, brought out the Eiffel Tower. Hi, Coco. And then there's the bouquet that we made. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this. We bought this like for um, like Halloween. So we're gonna go ahead and take this in the front. And we're gonna put these away. And we'll clear those out later. Have you been digging in here again? Come here. Come here. Did you do that? Every single day, I have to clean up after you. Are you not paying attention? Barbie? Barb. You are something else. Oh, don't even get in the dirt. Come on. Oh, oh my gosh. You're crazy. Gives it a little bit of height. And then there is with it on. So pretty. And then what we're gonna do with this is we're gonna put it up here. I think this looks so pretty. And again, I really wanted to put this in the front room, but the kids eat this, especially Coco. So I'm gonna go ahead and light that up for you guys. Oh, that is so pretty. So here's with the lights off. And we still have some things that we want to take care of. This table is gonna go right here. And again, as far as decorations, I just want to put, I just wanna put some things out and keep them out all year because in the YouTube world, we are like putting things up, taking it down, and it gets a little crazy. And um, I have, you know, I'm, I'm very, very busy. So, and I know all of you are too. So yeah, I'm, you know, just do a little bit at a time. And I'm not gonna do the entire house like in three or four weeks. I don't have time for that. And if I really did want it clean like that, I would hire somebody to do that. So just a little bit at a time and you guys can do it. And then it's just not overwhelming. Okay, so these are the real ones. I don't dump these. And look, look how realistic that is. And I really thought these were just so faux looking and I didn't realize they pretty much do look like the real thing. And I'll show you the white ones. Because look at that, I mean, you really can't tell the difference. Peonies are like actually one of my favorites. 
And again, I have to work for the next few days. So these only last probably, they say five days, I say like two, and we buy them once a year. So that's why I'm gonna keep them in the fridge. And you guys, these were literally closed. They were all closed. And guess what? They opened in the car. They opened just from the heat. So yeah, we're definitely gonna put these back in the fridge. This is Coco's, well, actually Barbie's favorite toy. And there you go, I know, so exciting. Okay, you stay over there with your little toy. So actually, right around the fireplace, we actually moved a few items, as you can see in the next few clips. So yeah, this right here was up on the mantel, and we actually had a white branch behind it that, you know, what, what you can do is when you do have items, you can kind of like hide them. You can kind of like hide them behind things if you want to um, put them out, you know, for display later on in the year. So yeah, I think they came out so cute. We have our candles burning. And these again, I got from Home Goods. These are Uggs and they're not cheap, okay? And we have a smaller one. These, I don't know, I think this is a little bit too much. Um, but yeah, we're gonna find something more to do with them a little bit later. And oh yes, oh Barbie, oh my goodness almost knocked this over see so yeah, over here we have the forever roses over here I did get this from Tarjay a long time ago and you guys this is um, this has uh, this is glass right here this is open and it came with these three little plants and this does this does open at the top and then we just have below some like a little bit of flow full plants and right over there, I did clean my Dyson. So look for that, uh, how to clean your Dyson vacuum in a future video. So that's drying in the sun. So yeah, just very simplistic. Everything can be put away rather quickly. So that you're just not tied down decorating. I mean, being a YouTuber, it's like decorate, put away, organize. And you know, um, we just want to enjoy a little bit more of our life, so. Right here, you guys. Okay, so these are the ones that I did get from Home Depot like before the pandemic because they haven't had any $5 orchids on Black Friday for a long time. You guys, look at this. Oh, so excited. Look at that. It's going to this one. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at that. How pretty that is. So, so excited. This has a little baby right here. And this one's really growing and this one's growing a little another shoot and this one has a little baby growing right there and this was in the other room and I decided just to put this right here because we have a little bit more Sun and again very simplistic this is a present for my sister <laughs> so right here my mom actually had made this this is kind of like a cutting board for like when you make quilts I love tulips are my favorite so yeah, these are the, again, the cups that we're going to get rid of. And this right here, I actually got this from Home Goods a long, long time ago. And what you can do is you can take your special recipes and these are just packets from flowers and then pin them on here. And I mean, I think it looks so pretty. And again, just very, very simple for spring, very easy to put away. And, you know, good for spring and summer actually instead of just decorating for spring. And that will stay out until the fall. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video today. Thank you so much for tuning in and I will see you next time. XO. Oh, thank you. You're so good to me. Thank you.